I don't think in this country at this age in time should be so much poverty in here. And I know a lot of people don't think that this country ha has any poverty. You know, I actually heard that comment from several people and I just couldn't believe my eyes or my ears. Maybe that's a, that's a wish in a lot of people's minds, you know, that, uh, that America doesn't have poverty, but there's a lot of poverty around. They just have to look a little bit harder or look, because I don't think some of them are looking at all. Poverty is like scraping the bottom, bottom of the barrel. You're trying to uh, see your way out of a situation as far as not being able to pay your bills, not being able to buy furniture, and not being able to eat, especially when you're a diabetic. It's, it's like being smacked in the face and kicked because you can't find and you have to deal with um, handouts. You're alone. You know, it's, it's like being alone in a world, like somebody is kicking you in your teeth when you're doing the best you can to survive. That's what I feel that poverty means. It's degrading. Everybody has their hard times, and you know, the higher class can go to the middle class and think that's poverty. But until you've lived through a week where you couldn't look at another ramen noodle, um, I think that you don't really know what poverty is. Staying alive, staying healthy, staying fed, keeping a roof over your head, holding the family together into one unit. That's the struggle in America. And that's poverty in America. You ask me for, how would I describe it? There it is, right there. You're born to struggle and you struggle all your life. There is no easy time. Every minute of the day, you're thinking of every other minute of the day and how you're gonna get through that. And then every other minute after that. Low income, no health care. hold your family together, and <laughs> peace of mind. You know, a little sanity, you know. You know, sometimes you really have to check your medication. 